Hi everyone, Kat here again. Today I'm making a very simple salad. It's called Supak in Lao and it consists of this watercress. Watercress can be found at your local Asian grocery store. So, what you will need is about two pounds of watercress, rinsed real good and washed. Okay, so two pounds of watercress. You will also need one can of chopped water chestnuts, one can water chestnuts, half a cup of white onion, one third cup sliced ginger, one tablespoon of roasted sesame seed, three tablespoons of badak sauce. Now badak, if you don't have any, you can just use fish sauce, okay? Three tablespoons. Half a tablespoon of MSG, one teaspoon of chili powder, one teaspoon of galanga powder, and one and one half tablespoon of roasted rice powder. Okay? Okay, next step, you want to bring some water to a boil and you want to cook your water chestnut. Now water chestnut is already pre-cooked but I like to cook them again anyway so just go ahead and throw this in there. Just basically I'm just kind of warming it up. <laughs> okay and then next you want to quickly um, blanch your water chestnuts. You don't want to overcook it, so you want to just, just stick them all in here. And just blanch it, okay? You have to excuse me, I only have two hands, so I'm going to turn this off for a second. Okay, after it's been quickly blanched, you want to go ahead and drain it and now rinse it with cold water. You do this so that it will stop the cooking process and also it helps to keep the watercress um, stay green. Okay, so you want to rinse it with cold water until the vegetable is no longer warm to the touch. Okay? Then what you want to do is just go ahead and squeeze out as much as possible all the water from the water press because you don't want to have a watery salad. So squeeze it out, okay, like that, and put it in a mixing bowl and continue to do all this until there's no longer any water in them, okay? Okay. Once we have all the water squeezed out, this is what it looks like. It's pretty dry. Okay, um, these watercress are pretty long and stringy, so if you don't like them too long, you can go ahead and cut them or chop them up into little bite sizes. But I like mine stringy and long, so I'm going to keep them like this. And all we need to do is add the rest of our ingredients and just toss them. So here goes. The onion ginger, or dried uh, seasonings, and how about that? Okay, and you just mix them all, toss them all in together. Be sure your hands are washed clean before you're doing this, or you can use tongs and whatnot if you don't want to touch them like I do, but I like to feel my food, so this is what I'm going to do. <laughs> okay. So. And pretty much you're just tossing all the seasoning until everything is equally mixed. And here you have it, folks. After it's been tossed with the rest of the seasoning, this is a watercress and water chestnut salad. I did add two more tablespoons of badak sauce and another half tablespoon of MSG to this dish. So add accordingly to your preference. Seasoning is all about preference, right? So just add accordingly. And this is it.
my soup pot a very crunchy savory and flavorful easy salad thanks for watching guys i hope you enjoy this recipe please don't forget to share and subscribe thank you